solid ball construction. Here we are showing how to build a solid ball structure with thin joint. In this case we are using 200mm solar grade Celcon Plus blocks. You can see that I am using the sanding board on the base course. We are looking for a pretty perfect base here so I will make sure the surface is completely clean. This will include brushing in any loose material off the block work. What I will be demonstrating here is the use of the sledge to apply the mortar for the bed joints. We are using blocks here that are 200mm wide by 610mm long. As you can see I have already mixed the self-fix mortar to the required consistency and I am filling the sledge up with the mortar. Just grab the sledge by the handle, open the gate which is just a simple handle you lift up. Then you simply pull the sledge along. As you can see, I'm going down one side of the block with a scoop and I'm placing the other side of the perp on that side of the block. I'm a bit restricted as the guide is on the scoop itself. Push the perp joints up tight and drop into the bed joint. Move on to your next block straight away. You can see on the face side of the next block are a couple of chips in the surface, which is quite permissible. If it's a really large piece missing, then the block should be put aside for cutting. If you do get imperfections on the block, a simple dab of mortar will keep the block work looking nice and tidy. And that's all you need to do. Check the block work is level again and plumb the block work. Once done, range the level through the block work just to make sure the block is where it should be and that's your course done. There is an internal partition wall coming off the solid wall and I'm just measuring up and marking where the internal wall is going to be. I'm marking the thickness of the wall on the block work because I need to insert an internal partition wall tie to tie my internal wall to. Here is the internal partition thin joint tie going into position. It's just inserted into the mortar joint and my block will be laid on top which will tie my internal partition wall to the solid wall construction. Clean the block wall off and keep it nice and tidy then revert to the level again and continue with the next course of blocks.